Hey, it's Michael with the Black Belt Project, and in this video, I wanted to talk more about you know small changes and how to go about making those in your life. And in particular today, I wanted to talk about how often to make small changes, how often to kind of institute them into your you know into your schedule. So, if you watched my last video, you know I kind of just added one small change, and from now on, I'm just going to call these things tasks. I'm not going to call them changes, but uh, um, you know I was. Basically, it was a pretty simple thing. I let set the bar really low so I could have um, the easiest chance of success of you know making sure I accomplish that through the day. And then the rest of the day, if I did everything, you know, on top of that, it's just kind of gravy. So um, you know what I want to do is kind of set a bar, and I'm going to end up calling that the mental strength bar of how far I want to go every day. And I'm going to keep adding small changes until, for some reason, I just can't anymore. So one of the things that, you know, it's going to be kind of something you're going to have to figure out on your own a little bit is how often should you make small changes. And so here's what I'm going to suggest that you do. So like here, you can see I'm kind of putting on, you know, on a yellow pad here, just simple things to start out my day. Like I'm going to get up and then I want to drink uh, more a glass of water, but you know I want to go to the bathroom first. So I'm starting to think sequentially here, and then you can see I've drawn a line here where I've kind of put the bar. So if I do these three things, then anything else I do after that, that's great. But as long as I do these, that's the most important thing for a successful black belt project day. Okay, so. Now, how often should you put changes here? And I'm going to suggest you should add them daily until you get to the point where something doesn't uh, kind of falls out. So like if I went and I added four or five changes and then I could only did three of them, then I need to reevaluate adding additional changes kind of, you know, where I set the bar at here. So um, continue to think about you know, what your perfect day is, and that's what I'm doing. So, you know, in my head, I kind of already have some things I've already kind of thought out about what I want to do, and I'm kind of starting just with the very beginning of the day, and then I'm thinking of the ideal next step. And it's kind of silly here, you know, these little tiny things, but the idea, too, is we're going to get all this stuff out of our head and onto some sort of capture device so that we don't have to think about those things. But for this video, the main point I wanted to get across is, is that you want to continue to add small changes as long as those changes continue to get done each day. And then when you get to the point where you have a change fall through, where you didn't actually complete them all that day, well, then you need to kind of say, okay, that's where my mental strength is. That's how far I got. So I need to kind of stay at that level for a little while until you're capable of pushing through it. Okay? so. And I'll be back again uh, in the next video to talk about my changes. You know, in the comments below, you know, talk to me about what kind of changes uh, you might be making and kind of, you know, where the bar is for you as you're starting out because I'm interested in hearing. And then as I get time, I'm going to put together some sort of audio um, instructional situation, or instructional CD that I'm going to put on iTunes, and when I do that, I'll probably put it in uh, a link to it in the corner there. So I'm starting to kind of think about how I want to do that. But right now, I just want to kind of make sure that, you know, regardless of where I am, what I'm doing, I just want to kind of give you an update on my progress. So I met the things I wanted to do today. I added an additional task for tomorrow, and I'm thinking sequentially. So that's what you want to do too. So I am Michael. Here's to mastering your life one belt at a time, and I'll see you in the next video.